Here is a grade 9 classroom I observed in California. The teacher there is an English language arts teacher and he's very drawn to all kinds of things but most notably inquiry, investigation of real world issues, critical thinking, developing vocabulary and communication skills with his students. And so what he's doing with them in this classroom is he's having them look at a Esri story map. It's a live web map. And in this case, he's having them look at doctors per capita and access to health care. So the students have a series of questions that the teacher designed to go through. And as they do that, they are not just thinking about maps and spatial information, but they're thinking about the actual issue that he's having them examine, notably health care in America and the diversity and disparities that exist. So he's having them think about lots of things. STEM education for one, science, the, t the science of, of medicine, uh, technology, they're using ESRI story maps, live web maps on the computer. They're looking at mathematics, so looking at ratios of doctors per capita and all kinds of other things. They're looking at communication, reading and writing, and interpreting the results, critical thinking. They're also looking at geography and how things are spatially related at different scales across the planet, in this case across the U.S., from local neighborhood to census tract to county to state level uh, scales. So it's really fascinating because, as you can see here, um, the teacher has a high level of engagement with the students. Now, he, this is during the explanation part, and he actually did have them work independently for most of the class period, which was about an hour. Note that also they are in the library. They have a fair amount of space, so the teacher and the students can actually interact with each other without crowding into and bumping into each other. So they have plenty of physical space. They also have enough, enough bandwidth in the school to be able to run the web maps because it does require a certain amount of bandwidth. Also, I noted when I was there that there was the social studies content curriculum uh, coordinator for the whole school district was observing as well. And she was very supportive of what this teacher was doing. So having that administrative support is critical also. This was very much tied to the standards for the school, for the district, for the state. And the teacher is using innovative methods to get the students engaged. And they were very engaged throughout the whole, uh, not only this class period, but others that I observed. Thanks.